Welcome to BPM Bullets Per Minute, where every song is 88 BPM. <laughs> this song took a very, sorry, this game took a very long time uh, for me to come around to. Uh, it came out in September of last year, and I did play it when it came out, and I was just a little turned off by a handful of things. Uh, I decided to go ahead and hop into it. Steam told me, I said, hey, you know, there's an update for this thing. Why don't you go check it out? And I was like, well, sure, I guess I'll go and check it out. And so I did. And I have been kind of hooked, just kind of hooked. Uh, you know, the, uh, the one of the biggest problems I had, maybe I was just being too much of a snob or something like that, was that every single song is 88 BPM. So it kind of made me feel like gypped. Because I was like, oh, this is a rhythm-based roguelike shooter. I feel like there should be different speed songs that would change the way that you play, right? That's kind of what I thought. Uh, but that's not the case. Every song is the same BPM, uh, 88 or 176, which is just double time BP uh, 88. Uh, and so I, I was kind of turned off by that initially. But you know what? The songs don't suck. Like, these are some solid ass, like, just rock songs. Uh, and, you, and, you know, they, they the rhythm is perfect for what you're doing. Uh, you can double time the beat, and you'll see. Everything has to be to the beat. Again, you'll see all that. Um, and you know, it's. I feel like if it was any faster, any slower, that would be nice. But I'm still enjoying myself playing it at the same BPM. Uh, <laughs> it's just like a, just like a, just a mixtape, same BPM all the way through. Uh, so I, I'm gonna continue this uh, final fight here. Uh, I did a run. You can see it took 62 minutes and 57 seconds, uh, and it's uh, full auto, which is basically just a variant where like every weapon fires automatically, so you don't have to do the rhythm thing. Uh, but you could, you still end up doing the rhythm thing anyway. So. Uh, it's on hard mode too, so it was kind of a bitch, but I ended up being pretty OP, which is, again, with most roguelikes, uh, you will have runs where sometimes you will just be OP, and then other times you will, like, literally not find anything, and it's huge pain in the ass. Um, there's one thing I want to do, though. There is a dish over here, and I don't know exactly what it does, but I have 50 coins. I'm gonna drop them all in there and see what happens. Drop them all in the dish. Drop them all in the dish. Don't know what this does. Okay. Well, nothing. <laughs> this is my this is actually my first time making it to the end here so uh and so uh I, so stuff like that it's like new game mechanics no idea uh but overall though like it has just been a stellar run just so many different like uh, uh level sets texture sets tile sets bio oh gosh whoa did some damage there didn't i so i'm gonna explain what's going on here so basically this is a boss rush right uh, it's gonna bring out- whoops, wrong button. Dang, that was a huge waste. That was a monster waste. Oh no! I may not pass this. So yeah, this is the boss rush. This is the last fight. Last fight. That's Nidhogg up there at the top, so we gotta fight him next. Or actually, when we're done clearing all these guys. Uh, I have a rocket launcher. You can have a pistol. You can have a machine gun. You have all kinds of stuff. I also have the right-click ability, which shoots that wave straight across right there. Just like that. And it does a fair amount of damage. Especially these little guys that fly around here. Just roast them. That guy's done. Now, uh, let's see, bottom left corner you can see that I have a cluster of different, uh, I guess like augments or abilities, or well, actually they can be abilities, but in this case they're just all passive. You can see my stats all the way across here. My damage is almost maxed out, which is one of the reasons why I'm doing so well. Uh, cause I'm just, I'm just I'm basically just roasting all these dudes. Oh god, these are the worst. Oh man, they throw that thing so fast. Oh wow, that was the fastest I've ever cleared those things. That might be a good sign get started in the cutscene so as I mentioned everything has been done to the beat so if you notice all my firing is on the beat on the rhythm even my reloads are at one like one sixteenth no <laughs> you gotta be fast man you gotta be fast oh man this is gonna be rough these orbs do damage everything does damage Keep on missing. So I'm trying to figure out where I'm at on this map. Ah, that wasting that wasting that shot was just the worst. I don't know what his tells are. We can roast those things pretty quickly. That's just a dome. We can get around that. Gotta dive that. There we go. Oh, it's so close. Wipe those. Oh, she's. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, there we go.
<laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh man, it's so good. Like, like, I'm telling you, man, the game really took a long time to just, just really just, uh, for me to come around to it and just start playing it and really just, just enjoying it for what it is. Yes, I could be a huge music snob and be like, oh god, there's just too many, uh, there's just too much, uh, the same rhythm all the way, the same BPM all the way through. It's just, like, uh, just stupid. Just get over yourself. Uh, the music is good. The, uh, the levels are great. It's all tile-based, right? So everything is, um, everything is random. Nope, just get out of the way here. You do have a dodge also that you can go through. This is all boring compared to what we just did, by the way. <laughs> we just fought a dragon in, like, another realm or some shit. So, this is good, actually, because we can explain some of the other focus points here in terms of uh, what the stuff you could do in this room already there's a couple things we don't want to point out so first off there's coins on the ground right this would be a, a room clear oh, i thought it was a flawless clear Did i take damage no i didn't do it fast enough so there's a chest that appears after you uh after you uh clear the room and it can have coins it can have health it can have keys something like that right there's also these little augment things that show up all over the place you put this uh, put a coin in put a little halo over his head and you get some range up sometimes there's damage sometimes there's luck uh, there's already a chest over here, but it requires a key, so we have to come back later. And then what, uh, what's through this door? <laughs> as, as you've seen with most, um, uh, roguelikes, sometimes you can just, like, walk right into the boss. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna walk right up to him, start, yeah. But no, 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 oh gosh. No buffs or anything. Well, whatever, whatever that one was we got was a range. Another thing that kind of turned me off initially, as a classic first-person shooter player, right? Is that you had a range limit, and I was like, that is so weird! It's a stat you can, you can actually, uh, whoa, 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 you can put points into, or you can, uh, find those little, uh, prayer things. Oh, gosh. But every run I've done has been so drastically different. Like, they have quite, oh gosh, oh man. I don't know which side he's at. Okay, good. This is such a great, such a great attack. I love that. I don't think I've seen it in any other game. That little click, 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 click. That's me missing my, uh, my rhythm here. Oh, damn. But we are on hard. It's fine. It's fine. But like I said, there's every single run has been just completely different uh you know one run i'll make it all the way to the end and another run i will uh make die in the second room uh this is a challenge room i'm just giving you guys a tour that's all this is the challenge room so you hit that button all these things pop up you got a lot of enemies to juggle here they're all gonna be charged all over the place don't shoot that thing until the very end please these things i think are fine but i think they blow up they blow on something else yeah that was a bad, bad idea also damn now i have a million things to deal with I'm doing something hard. It's ridiculous. It's not easy. You guys are gonna see shit today. Oh! Oh my god! I got killed by a fly. Shut up! <laughs> god, man, this is the. Way I've had so many good runs. That's a tre treasure room. We're gonna get anything there. I've had so many good runs. Something to note too. I uh, so it does have kind of this like inclined like speed boost there. Look at that. So anytime you're going down a decline, I should say, when you go down a decline, you can do this. Kind of feels like, uh, like you're like you're skiing. Shazbot. Do you get a little bit of speed boost every once in a while? So you see me do that. Your character can move ridiculously fast after you get a good handful of buffs. By the way, like stupidly fast. These things require a key, uh, which I don't have. I think you choose one of the other three disappear. Or other two disappear. Uh oh. Oh. Yes, that's what those do. They explode, I guess. Oh, gosh. Also, there's another character you could choose, but it um, has a revolver. And I'm not really a fan. Not so much the revolver. It's the uh, fact that I don't think he can actually take any heals. This heals don't work on him. And I'm just not about that kind of stuff. <laughs> I'm just not quite ready for that kind of commitment. My starting health is my health, period. 
could be wrong, but yeah, like that health right there I just picked up. I'd keep walking through it every time I choose that guy. There's a challenge over there. We should probably do that. Uh, and over here, there's a store, but we can't get anything. The music is great, though. So clip up, we can get that for five coins. Over here, we get a, uh, this is like a revolver shotgun thing. Uh, and then just a regular, like, AR sort. It's got, like, nine shots, something like that. Where it shoots uh, automatic, or like a three-round burst, I think. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Is there anywhere to put my money in here? Usually they're off in the corner somewhere. Uh, hmm, no, no. Oh gosh, they're on the side too. Dang. Damn. There you go. Even reloading gotta be all the time, man. You gotta have the rhythm. Sometimes it's hard, especially when you're talking. <laughs> oh, this is the bank, by the way. I believe I can go take some money out of this. Look at that. I have 10, 10 points in the bank. There's no bank music. I'm a little sad about that. So the bank basically shows up in random maps. And then you can choose to throw some money into it if you'd like. Uh, and then it'll show up in other runs. Like this, that was a completely different run that I went and I dumped those coins into. You can only put it in 10 at a time, though. Uh, like 10 per trip. Where am I going? I'm going to go do this challenge. I'm going to try to get some money here. I didn't think it was really worth it, but then once they limited me to 10, I was like, oh, okay, I get it. Because by the end of the game, I was just swimming in money. So I was just like, well, I don't understand why I need... Well, at that point, I realized, it's like, well, I'm not going to use all this money. I mean, as you guys saw at the beginning of the video, I ended up throwing it all away. So... Oh, come on. Flying thing. The flying thing I'm trying to get first. Play the whole, whole last run with a damn rocket launcher. Now I can't shoot a regular hit scan. So annoying. Oh my god, I can't believe this. <laughs> I can't believe this. We're going to easy mode, damn it. Oh my god, unbelievable. Easy mode. I, you know the other character right here. Uh, yeah, it doesn't tell you much about it, but uh, yeah, when I was playing it, it did not pick up any uh, any of the. Uh, did you finish the rocks to unlock? Okay. Um, yeah, it didn't uh, give me any health. And I was just like, I'm not playing like that. We're going easy. <laughs> god, you guys are not going to see shit. Uh, but each run can be up to an hour long, so if this video is an hour long, then that means I made it. <laughs> that means I made it. Uh, but no, I'm not going to go that far in. If we end up going uh, anywhere, we'll just go a few handful of levels so you guys can see this is the general game flow. And then I'll go, uh, oh. Oh, see? Oh. Done. Done. Let me see anything. Oh, here we go. God, see, this is, this is why we gotta do easy so we can see everything. So basically, you stab yourself and you get coins. And I got a handful of coins. It's a pretty good deal. The challenge in that back room there, but apparently I'm really bad at those, so we'll just go ahead and just uh, forget about it. Although it does got good stuff though. Uh huh. Oh, another thing I can stab myself to get some more coins. Oh, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> There's a boss fight in there. Easy, I better be able to just kill that guy immediately. Here we go. So, uh, just a quick note. That sometimes you get enough coins, or most of the time you get enough coins in order to, if you know where a shop is, um, then you can uh, just come back and get your health back for two coins. You always get more than two coins in those things. So it's always worth it to go ahead and uh, stab yourself and then come and just buy yourself some more health and then you make a profit on it. Uh, let's see, uh, activate jump. What? Ah, triple jump. Okay. Yeah, that's what worked out. Cool. Max HP four, and then I'll have enough to. Uh, this was at four, and I can't afford that. We'll just go to full health a little bit. Look from there. There's no health regen when you go to the next level, by the way. Like it's gone. Like well, it's gone until you get some health from a health thingy, which I think we may have passed one up. Maybe we didn't pick one up in one of the previous rooms. We are gonna do that challenge, by the way. <laughs> oh, that was another run. I'm getting my runs mixed up. <sighs> I can't remember these guys spawn right there. I spent so much time in the later levels, I forgot what's in the first one. Ha 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 ha! Right? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Two shots of these guys, huh? There you go. Coins, coins, coins. You know, I did an entire run, entire first level. Oh, gosh. They gave me a chest, I can't even open it. Uh, I, I ran an entire first level and died on the boss. Many bosses like this are pretty good. He gave me a key. But, uh, not a single coin drop. Like, if I mentioned that earlier, like, I was not even kidding. Like, there's not a single coin drop in an entire run. And it was just... Ah, some help. Um, 
It was painful. Like, it was, no, you need coins for everything. So I could open this up now if I wanted to, which I'm going to. And I get, oh my god, a oh, set of boots. Crap. But so, so I want, here's the thing. Do I want to have a uh, triple jump or do I want deals percentage damage, whatever that means? What does that even mean? Deals percentage damage. Sure. Is that very literal? Like, instead of doing, like, number damage, it does, like, 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 regular whole number damage, it does percentage instead? I don't understand. Oh, see, a key could open this up, and I could have got that little book back there. I, I, I sat there and told you guys that, you know, the songs are pretty good, despite all being 88 BPM, and what did I do? I played the same level over and over again. <laughs> you gotta taste this other room, you're fine. Alright, we'll skip that. We'll skip that challenge. We're gonna go right for the boss. Right for the boss. Let's do it. Jump off this thing, get some speed. Oh, triple jump would've carried me there. Oh, god, I already regretting it. You can run up on this dude and start shooting before this thing even ends, but it's too far. I don't remember what that attack is. Oh, that thing. Three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, Oh man, oh the fireworks, everything, so good. See, ability up, sweet, and we're gonna get out of here. Let's go. Uh, now, some of the tiles actually have um, hidden areas you could go jump up to. There's like a, like a little uh, uh, parkour puzzles and shit that they kind of scattered about in some of the tiles. Um, oh, there's a thing right here, but I only have two coins, but I do have a key, so I need to find a place in that key. So both of those rooms I can't really afford to go into right now. Whoa. Also, the enemies sh uh, shoot on the beat too, I believe. Yep. Mm, one more guy. What do we got here? Some health. Oh, good. Max health, 125. So, like, for example, if there was something over here, I could hop over here and get to it, right? They have little little hidden alcoves like that. Get a little perks and get whatever. Oh, come on. You know what it is? I should have played earlier when I was like on a hot streak. I was on a hot streak, man. I wasn't missing any of my shots. Mm-hmm. Let's see. There we go. There we go. Stab myself for some what? For some max HP? Hell yes. 150? I ended the last mat run at like 250 or something like that. Pretty good having a shitload of health. I had like a regenerating armor thing. I don't know how that thing worked, but every once in a while I just had armor, so I didn't really complain. There you are. Let me see. Some more money. Is there anywhere to put my money in here? Yes, right here. What do you have? Uh, damage up? I'll take that. There we go. Challenge in the other room right there. We gotta at least do one. Oh. Oh, hold on. That's just a... That's not... I thought that was uh, another stab yourself and get, get loot thing. Hold on. Come on, guys. Yeah, get me over here. Too far. Mm -mm. Playing games with me. Oh, it is. Okay, I didn't realize it didn't show up till the end there. Ooh, okay. We'll remember that. We'll remember that, actually. More coins. I have 11 coins. Still, I'll probably take me to like 16. I mean, I'll definitely get it back. There is a shop at the very beginning, but I'm gonna go to that shop and we'll go past this thing anyways. This guy usually you can finish. Oh, jeez. That usually you can him, finish him off super fast. There you go. But it missed my beat. What, I got two, two keys now? Anything in here? There's not usually anything in here. Alright, so I'm going to buy it, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, stab myself. And I got myself a handful of coins. We'll skip the challenge, it's fine. We're on easy, we don't have any problems, right? So it looks like the boss is absolutely in the other direction. Ah, look at this, luck up, sure, that means more coins, more good things, I guess. Alright, so we buy some. Let me see. What is this one? Five for a revolver. I guess I should get the revolver at some point to show you, but. Mm, 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 mm. We'll go to the other one because I'd rather get the, the, the boosts. Instead of the weapons. Let me see. 
Although there's a surprisingly low number of opportunities to swap weapons actually as you play. Ooh, a hat. What is this thing? Uh, rotate ability slots. Well, I don't need to do that, so. Uh, I see. So this is going to increase the max HP, max HP. Wow, two of them? Holy crap. Yeah, we'll get both. And then we'll, what, 50 HP? That's a four and a two. Oh, man. Look at this. Oh, man, I'm a tank. I'm a tank. See? See? Good thing we didn't spend our money. Good thing. Dang. Now we're broke, but we have a key, though. Oh, gosh, there's a lot of guys in here. Okay, I'm going to shut up for a second. Oh, gosh, I just got to reload. <laughs> Let's take care of whoever the stragglers are. Oh, we get everybody else rounded up. These guys. I swear the AI is stupid, but then it starts doing these flanking maneuvers, and I'm like, what is what? <laughs> One minute they're like running into a corner, just like all by themselves. Come on. And then the next second, they're <laughs> they're like flanging me and trying all these maneuvers. It's like, well, come on, dudes. Oh. Oh, you still got me, son of a... Let's get all these coins up. That was a busy room. There's a bank in there, by the way. Uh, so this is, uh, you basically throw a bunch of coins in and they might get something. It's seriously, it's like you might get something. Let's see what we got in here. Coins, cool. We could throw some away. Come on, last coin, last coin, let's make it happen. Yeah, fire spread of projectiles. Whoa, cool. Oh, that's a fast cooldown too. Oh, this is gonna be a pretty sick run. We got lots of health, we got some cool abilities now. Wow. He has an ability where he's gonna target me in a second. That one right there. Oh, gotta move. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the fireworks and the fanfare. It's so good. Come on. Ability up. That's what we want now because now our shotgun blast, our shotgun hands are going to be just super sick. Vanaheim, here we go. Level two. Or world two, whatever. 88 BPM. Same BPM. Oh, there's a thing on the floor. Okay, he beats the water. No, what does he do? What's his tell? Okay, it's gone now. Okay, I got a key out of this guy, though. Jeez. No loot? I guess not. It's key. No loot? Hold on, that's weird. Yeah, no loot. It glows usually, like a beam of light. God light on it. Hmm. Whoa! God, that's unfair. Oh, one shot those guys. Too far away, too far away. We don't have to reload that thing, so it's fine. We need to take care of all the flying things. Get those guys way over here, trying to start some mess. Here we go. How does these guys deal with? Whoa. Shouldn't rely on that. One more. What? Oh. Nice, nice, nice. Sloppy, but nice. Aha! Here we go. I didn't think I'd ever get this thing again. Oh, gosh. Oh, you know what? Gosh, I'm going to stab myself. I got six gold. Hold on a second. I can jump up there, right? Yeah, okay. So, yeah, I can stab myself and get some more gold. But I need to find a room that sells health, which is not here. Hmm. Yeah, I don't gotta worry about weapons anymore. Let's do with this. And then. Let's 
just gotta stay alive, you know? See, my aim is so much better with splash damage. <laughs> Health, or sorry, uh, coins. Fine, I'll take all the coins I can get. Another one. Oh, man, I can kill myself right now. All those two. Aha, aha. So what do we have? What do we have? Ooh, 50 HP, 50 HP. For what, four and four? I can four both those right now. Oh, God, and more. Oh. Oh, what is this? What is this? What is this? Uh, reflect damage. I don't know how good that thing is, but oh man. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Uh, well, first we're gonna take one for sure because we're gonna be hurting after we take one or stab ourselves once. But we'll see how much coin we come back. But we definitely gotta use them both. So boom. Ooh. Walk around with a rocket hanging out there. Okay, get up here. Get this one. So yeah, super super high jump. That's the that's how you go up against this and then you jump. <laughs> So going up, you get a super high jump. Going forward, you basically just go fast. Okay, so let's go 50 health. We definitely have to get one more of those things, but we can at least afford. Uh, how much were those? Like four or six? Probably four, I think. Oh man, we might be in luck here. Oops. Uh, let me see, max HP. Yeah, one. And then uh, two. And then three. Oh man, we gotta get some health. We gotta. Hope the RNG gods shine on us right now because we need it. We need that. Those health files we see. Oh. This guy's rush. Oh. Get those coins. Where I can put coins to get something. Fuji's behind here. Uh, more coin. Oh man, I'm gonna be rich. Well, nine gold's not really rich. There's the oh god, the boss behind that door. I might be able to take the boss as is. Honestly, it's hundred health. Like it's not like it's it's not like I'm I'm like at twenty five health or anything like that. It's still, oh, respectable. No, oh, get out of the way. Oh, dude. Where's he at? There he is. Oh. I'm not counting this at all. Okay. You know, the pickup range is a little bit short for coins. You have to, like, seriously just step on them. <laughs> you like, hacky them up into your freaking purse. Whoa. Oh, 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 lock myself in the corner. Makes me want to play another tournament. There we go. I'm just really trying not to die because this is a good amount of health. I want to make this happen. This guy wants a key for uh, something. That's worth it. I have so many keys right now. And that's a little bit of health. Good. Drop it a key. Ooh, he wants more than one key. Oh, this guy's a dick. Ah, oh, good. Throw a coin. What? Fire spare with your coin? It does that literally shoot my coins? Oh my god. What a what a joke. Dang it! RNG. Better spend my coins than this. The wishing well here is pretty dope, actually. Throw this in here and it gives you a little option. It's like, oh, do you want this health? Oh, I took it already. Dang, okay. Um Oh, actually, yeah, I forgot you can keep on feeding him money. It'll just give you until it was shoot out an enemy. That's right. So, okay, ready. I think this one might do it. Oh. Oh, now it's trying to sucker me. Oh, it's broken now. <laughs> I had an enemy spawn out of there. Oh, last time I used this, I figured I was just every time. God, I can't believe I threw him with my keys, man. Got two keys left, so. Oh, gosh, they're right here. more damage I put into this thing. Like, this is gonna be lethal for bosses. Did I take damage there? Oh, it was flawless. Like, just absolutely lethal. I was a run, just run over bosses. This thing's hitting in the corner here. Ability up. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Challenge room. God, that might be really handy. I got the shotgun thing. Shotgun hands. Whoa. There's no splash damage. I shouldn't worry about that, actually. Yeah, I think it's useless on those things. 
I keep using that though. <laughs> hey, look at that. We finished the challenge room, guys. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, more coins. Oh, 13, 13 coins. God, you know, I'm, I'm so used to it. Like, I'm telling you, but by the time you get to the end of a run, you have, you're swimming like 60 to 75 coins. Easy. Easy. <sighs> All right. Is there anything else for me to get in here? I, I forgot. Again, we do have a respectable amount of health. Oh, I forgot I was playing this corner here, too. Come money all over the place. I'm just forgetting where it's at. So there's a, on the other side of this door. Yeah, we have a uh, chest we can open. And then behind here... Let me see. Speed multiplier. Oh, that's pretty great. That means every piece of speed we get, it's going to boost, boost even more. Now, this is going to do, uh, I think... I'm not going to do it because I want this health, um, but uh, there's a chest down there, and it's a good chest, but it's going to do, I think, 12 and a half damage per pass, so 25 damage total, so just so you guys know, if you want to do that on your run, but not today, Satan. Let's go. Boss time. I don't know how that mechanic works. Dun, 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 dun. What's he doing? Does he beat the drum? Uh oh, this is different. We got him. Hey, we got him. We got him. We got him. We got him. <laughs> Drop the key. Get a chest. And oops. 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 Damage up. Oh, the more damage we get. This rock a lot is going to be so nasty. Uh, we got 15 coins here. Did I buy everything I possibly could over here? Let me see. Yes, I did buy everything but for the helmet. But I have a helmet on right now. There's a challenge. There's like an extra bonus crazy challenge over there, but I'm not doing it. <laughs> you can see on the mini map, by the way. Yeah. So we got 20 minutes on this run. Boy, we're doing pretty good. And we still have a lot of levels left. Like, this is not the... Uh, we're, we're not celebrating or anything yet. Let's go into this challenge room here. Ah, there's a little... Oh my god, of course! Of course, I should have done that! Oh, man! Well, I guess you already saw how long the video was, so you already knew the outcome. <laughs> no surprise there! Ah, damn it! Well... Uh, like I said, the game took a while to grow on me because I was being a huge music snob at the beginning. Oh, it's called BPM, but there's only one BPM. <laughs> but it is, it, I mean, I've been playing it, uh, you know, for a couple nights here, uh, which is, which is longer than most games, <laughs> which is longer than most games. Uh, so yeah, it's, it's, uh, right now it's on Steam for $19.99. You can pick it up, um, you know, it's on sale or whatever right now if you want to. Uh, there's plenty of content, there's challenges here. I already did a couple challenges. Um, but yeah, the full auto, that's the one I completed, I showed you at the end of that one. Uh, in terms of like, you know, graphic settings and everything like that, you have an FOV slider down here, I believe, right here. Uh, I, I could probably open that up a little bit more, but I'm pretty comfortable where it's at in terms of distance. Um, but yeah, this is, uh, you know, it's, it's, a uh, it's a good game. It's a solid game. Uh, interface, user interface, what is this? I remember this. Uh, oh, alpha, ooh, and scale. Oh, great. That's awesome. Yeah, because a lot of times you don't need to even have half that shit up there. Um, you see to remember how many mag, how many, uh, bullets or, you know, uh, casings, shell casings that you have in your, uh, whatever weapon you have. Not counting like an idiot, just like click, 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 click. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, game's called Bullets Per Minute BPM. You can check it out on Steam, 1999. My name is Mike B, aka Phony. Thank you so much for your watching, for your watching, for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.